This is Jack from Utah. How did Lil Wayne write a better theme song than No Mercy? <sighs> it's called Rare Genius. It's called True Genius. It's called Goat Genius. I've mentioned this before. I'm going to say it again. For two years, he kept mentioning to me, you know, I... I I'm going to do a new theme song. He calls it an intro song. I'm going to do a new intro song for Undisputed. Okay, be my guest, but how can you get better than best? I mean, to me, No Mercy, it's, it's like a hit song. It's a classic. It's, if, if you put it out on the market, it would sell. And he did it for me and for us. And he says, he kept telling me, just, just watch. Just watch, I'm going to do it. Okay, Shannon leaves. All of a sudden, the opportunity presents itself. It rears its ugly head right there. It's like, okay, Wayne, you're on. I told him, look, if you want to just tweak the lyrics a little bit, you don't have to do a new song. I got this. I got this. Okay. Took a little while because we had a little while to play with because we we're on hiatus. All of a sudden, out of the, I didn't push him. I never asked, how you doing? I, did, I didn't ask anything. Genius at work. Let it lay. Stay away. It's midnight one night. My wife Ernestine and I are about to go to bed. Look at my phone. Text from Wayne. There's, there's no writing on the text. There's no script. It's just a song, it's just a song. And I'm like, wait a second. I, I, I think he just sent me a song. I don't know if it's an updated No Mercy or a brand new song, I don't know. She says, well, do you wanna wait until the morning? I said, no way. Well, she said, you know what's gonna happen? If you play that song right now, we're not gonna go to bed for like three hours, which we did not, but it was worth it because I played, I hit play, and we listened, and, and it was just, it was just surreal. I, I looked at her and I said, this is impossible. I got goosebumps, hair raised on arms. I said, he just did a whole new song about me and Undisputed, a whole new song, new lyrics, and then he sort of segued back into some Old Mercy, excuse me, that's Old Mercy now, No Mercy. And I listened a second time and a third time, and it took about four times to really let it sink in. And before I texted him back, I said, guess what? He just pulled off the impossible. He just created a song that I think is a little better than No Mercy. What? It's impossible. It cannot be. This song is so good that every day now, we've done three shows as I record, as I tape this, on Wednesday afternoon. It gets in my head and I can't get it out in a good way. I texted him after today's show. I said, it doesn't get old. It just gets better and better. I keep playing it over and over in my head. Skip the BS is the first line, which is the essence of me. It, 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 I, he, he always just nails it. He, he, he knows me. He gets me. He knows me on TV. He gets undisputed. He was obviously on Monday with me talking a little bit about this. He's very humble about these things. It's hard for him to talk about the creative process because in some ways, I think it's, it, it's almost a gift unto itself. Like, like he, he just sort of sits back and watches the gift take over and he's never sure exactly how is that happening? I don't know. Just thank you, God. It's, it, it just happens. And it, it doesn't astonish him at all. 
there was no, I can't believe what I just wrought. And he did tell me he was on pins and needles, that he was biting his nails for my response that night. And after the fourth listen, I texted him back, you know, just, I, I, I don't know how you did this, but you, you just pulled it off. You, you, you proved me wrong. You did better than the best. This song is better than No Mercy. And I think most people now, if you've heard it several times, maybe 10 or 12 times, I think you would agree. It's a little better than the best, No Mercy. This is called Good Morning. I mean, just the, the, the brilliance of, he, he opens up with, good morning. Okay, I, and Ernestine looked at me like, that's such simple genius. Like, yeah, it's a morning, it's a good morning song. Then I asked Wayne, what, what do we want to call it? We were right here in this studio doing the, the video shoot for it. He thought for a second. First he said, we could just call it Undisputed. And then he said, no, 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 just, just call it Good Morning. I said, okay, that works for me. So it's Good Morning. I hope you enjoyed that video. You ready for more? Make sure you click that subscribe button for all the exclusive content from The Skip Bayless Show. And don't forget, to check out the full episode of the show wherever you get your podcasts by clicking the link in the description.